Hi, everybody. Tinker77 here. Do you hear that? I don't hear it either. This is a silent dropper elevator that works in 1.15.2 of the Java version. And I'm going to show you how to build this right now. The first thing we have to do is make the dropper tower. This has to be an even number of droppers facing upwards. I'm going to make mine 12. So here we go. This is kind of hard doing this flying, but two, three, four, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ele ten, <laughs> eleven, twelve. There we go. We should have 12 droppers facing upward. Okay. Now down at the bottom, we're going to put where we put the input. We're going to have a hopper feeding into that bottom dropper and a chest. This is where we put stuff that we want to go up in our little dropper elevator. And right now I'm going to put a chest on top to receive those items. Okay. There we go. Now we got to get to the fun part, the redstone. What we want to do is we want to put a comparator output right here on the back. So this tells if there's anything in the dropper, this will fire this, this circuit off. Okay. We're going to put a block of your choice right there and a redstone torch. Now, basically, this torch will then lock these two hoppers in the back, okay? You want to have the two hoppers facing into each other. You can see that's facing this way, and I'll put this one facing that way, okay? They are facing each other. It doesn't matter, but basically, when this torch is on, it locks the hopper, which keeps them from moving their item across. So, you can see this item just stays right there, okay? So, coming back off of this is again, we want another comparator, okay? And that's basically saying, hey, does there anything in this hopper, which there isn't because it's locked. So when there's power here, turns off the torch, these start working, and this starts working, and yeah, it, everything works. <laughs> okay, so we have that there, and you want to put a redstone torch. You have a block and a redstone torch. Now, we're going to make a basic a basic tower here, so I'm going to do this pretty quick here. Basically, you want to go all the way up with blocks. And we're going to cascade the torches up. This should be pretty easy. I'm going to do this real quick. Okay. And then you basically want to alternate spots out of it here. This is your typical torch tower. And then on the inside of every block, you want to put a torch. Okay. This is pretty easy. Let's go all the way up here. Okay. Almost done. And then once we get to the top, we got to put one more set of torches down and this thing will be ready to go. Okay. There we go. And now on the outside of these blocks here facing like next to the droppers, Want to do that you'll hear them click that's the only time you'll hear them click okay so everything's ready to go nothing in the chest up here and let's see down here there's nothing in the chest down here let's grab um some stone i'm gonna put a half a stack in here 32 stone we're gonna hit the thing and all of a sudden you see the torches just magically blink kind of like it's christmas but if you notice there's no sound at all it's silent so then we're gonna go up here in just a second we'll watch all the torches finish blinking see if they all the way up and should be done any second I'm waiting for it waiting for it there it goes everything's done and up here we have 32 items just like that now this is great if you're going up into a chest but typically you want to move it from here into some other like storage system or something like that so instead let's do this let's uh, take some, uh, some blocks here we're gonna go out a little bit and let's say you wanted to go into uh, a chest that's out here. Let's see here. Maybe put out here. What you do is you just put some hoppers on, and it should do the same thing here. Okay. So now if I do this and I put in, let's say, not do uh, 32. Let's do 16, so we don't have to wait as long. There's 16. And it should go all the way up, and we should see it coming up into here, and you see it's going up, and it should go to 16. Almost done here. So basically this dropper elevator, it's silent, but it does work. And it's something that you can do instead of water elevators. If you don't have water elevators or don't want to use them, or maybe the space isn't right for it, you can use this system right here. Well, that's it for this tutorial, guys. I'm going to put the world download in the description so you can grab it and take a look at it for yourself. And as usual, if you like this video, please click that like button. If you have any comments, put them down in the comment section. And if you would like to be notified of the videos I produce, please subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you get all the notifications. Okay, guys, thanks. Have a great day. Bye-bye.